Alright guys, Emerald Moroni here, and uh, welcome to Portal. Uh, this is my favorite game. I play Minecraft a lot, uh, but Portal is definitely my favorite game to play. Um, it's just not as playable as Minecraft. Um, I'm going to try and do a full playthrough of Portal 1, and then if you guys like that, I'm going to do another one through Portal 2. Um, but make sure, uh, say in the comments or leave a like to show me that you want to see Portal 2 or want to see the continuation of me playing through Portal. So let's just start up a new game and have fun. Yeah, started up the game. Radio Dance with the radio. Woo! Oh, radio convention. Hello and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope okay. your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before yes. we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities. Serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Magic! That was a great portal. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I don't know what my GLaDOS voice sounds like through recording. In real life, it sounds actually kind of creepy. But... <laughs> <coughs> yeah. You pick E to pick up an object. And drop it. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. I will. Test that that is what I do. Note the incandescent particle field across the exit. I can this see it. Aperture science material emancipation grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Oh, didn't vaporize me. Guess that's good. Don't kill me. Now I get to sit in an elevator with that weird glitchy light at the top. That always confused me. No idea why it's there. Sweet. Didn't even have to go through a loading screen. Test chamber one. One out of eight, 19. That's what this is. That's what this is right there. Um, no dangers. That's that is good. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. That is a very specific requirement. Oh my gosh, I thought I dropped it. Please move quickly to the chamber as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Okay, that's good. Sit in this place with cushy, gross looking mattresses on the walls. It's great. Aperture Science. What a great place to work. This game. You're doing very well. That, that is good. I'll expect that. Good. I'm glad it's unattended. Oh, I, I don't really want my teeth to be gone. So, I would prefer if that didn't happen, but, I mean, if you can't avoid it, Very then... Good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Sweet! With it, you can create your own portal. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Okay. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. 
Do okay. not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. That sounds like a good idea. Under no circumstances should move. Should I what? Now, now I don't know what I shouldn't do, so I can't do it. Man, this is too many requirements. Oh, this game is lagging a lot less than Minecraft does, even when I'm recording. It's great. Ah, oh, yay elevators. It's very dark in here. Die. Please proceed to the ah, Die. Mind the gap. Mind the gap. I I minded the gap. Are you proud of me yet, Glados? Because well I just then, passed your remember, really really simple test. Remember, the bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. I do not want my daughter to be tested because I don't have a daughter. So that would be a reason that I don't want her to be tested. But you know, jump around. Oh. Loading screen. That was a really short loading screen. Kill all the cameras! I don't want your security. Oh. I'm supposed to learn that you put the thing there. Pin. I'm uh, not companion cube. Cube rolls in. Plop that there. Really simple. As part Ow. of a required test protocol, Why you did will I take not monitor the really next test chamber. That. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Sweet. To ensure I'm the own. safe performance of all authorized activities, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Why not? I love destroying cameras. Is that what vital testing apparatus is? Because if it is, then I would love to do that. So, next test, there's no cameras. Switch! I can't destroy anything though. It makes me sad. I want to destroy everything. Mostly the cameras. Aperture Laboratories. A great place to work. Apparently, I could die by cube. That's a good thing to know. Die! Die! You won't die. For your own safety, ah, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Well, you said you wouldn't watch me, and there was a camera. So, I decided to destroy the camera so you couldn't watch me. You know, I'm just, I'm holding you to your word. I'm making you stay true to your word. Is, is there something wrong with that? But, where? Oh, it's right here. Where did it go for a second? I have no idea where it went. Yeah! Radio! As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. You're a jerk. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Certain objects may be vital to your success. No, they're not! Testing apparatus. I don't care about the cameras. You lied to me. I don't like you, GLaDOS. That's your name. I don't like it. I don't like you. I don't like your lies and enhancements and fabrication of the truth. You should be just honest with me. That would be a good idea. While safety is one of the unbelievable, you, subject name here, must be the pride of subject phone down here. <laughs> well, I'd solve that test really quickly. She didn't even get to finish saying what she was gonna say before I was just too amazing for her test, man. I know these maps. I've actually only played through Portal 1 once. But, I don't know, I really like this game because it... It makes sense with my mind. Portals, they make sense with my mind. They... My mind works that way. And, you know... Now use the 
Thanks for the advice, GLaDOS. At least there's not death water down below that. There's death water, and I think chamber 10 is where it starts. The death water. What chamber are we on right now? I don't even know. Seven! Sweet, almost there. So I'm going through these quick. There's only 19 of them. It only took me like, I think, four hours to do this the first time. So, the whole entire game, I mean. But I, I, it's gonna take a lot shorter. If I can beat this in under an hour, I will be very proud of myself. Sweet. Please note Number eight. that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record. Called death. Followed by death. Good luck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's nice. I don't want that to happen. Uh, you should make that not be a thing that happens. Yeah, you should do that. I'll bounce off that wall and go through that portal and smack into the reception thing. Right? Yep, guessed it. Sweet. Um, I need this. <laughs> and then I can put that right there. Correct? Yep, correct. I need to get the radio. I want to get the radio. That's going to be so hard. I'm going to die. Yeah, that water down there, that kills you. So, uh, that that would be a unsatisfactory, unsatisfactory mark on your official record. Die. <laughs> we do not Very want you. Please Aww. note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing really? experience. Oh, last time I did that, when I played it for the first time, I kind of died. And I don't think that was really a, a, an enhancement of reality, because I died. So... I mean, like enhancement of game reality. The enrichment really center happy. regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. It's not impossible. I've solved it before. I want the. I want the radio. I want the. Dang it. I want the. Why do I keep calling it a companion queue? That's way later on in the game. Apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. That was not extreme pessimism. I'm sorry, I don't know what your definition of pessimism is. Maybe you could search that up in your programming, but that was not extreme pessimism. No. That was just you trying to convince me that I was going to fail. So, oh, that was very nice of you. I, I definitely appreciate you doing that. I, I love it when you do that. <coughs> ah. That makes perfect sense. That, that makes perfect sense. I love this part. This part is so fun. Okay. So you place this here, then speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Yeah. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Wait, where's the radio? I need the radio. It's, it's there. Can't reach it. Yeah. Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In yeah, I can notice that. Speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. I told you, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing goes out. Speedy thing comes out. What the trippiness spinning around? That's my advice to all my friends. Speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. <laughs> Ah. I love this game so much. 
I don't even realize why now. I just, just love it. Yes. The enrichment center promises you always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the enrichment center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. <laughs> that is very useful advice. Try to avoid things that kill you. Um. I wish all my math teachers would tell me that, because that is the most helpful advice I've ever heard, personally. Definitely. Dang it! Why no? Oh, I wasn't gonna make it. <laughs> He's coming back through! I go out. No, you're supposed to go out the other. Ugh. Okay, I have to hit it after it does that. Right now. Yeah, that was perfect. Sweet. Uh, that's not where I want to be. Move me. Move me over there. I can't shoot a portal through a portal because that would make absolutely no sense. Oh, I love this game. Sweet. Right along this really, really, really slow moving platform. And then I think I'm supposed to grab this, right? Device has been modified so that it can now manufacture two portals at once. Sweet! As two portals. Optional test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject phone call. Yeah. Oh, that, that's nice. I'm worth less than this portal gun. That's that's a nice thing to say to me. Especially after you told me that this floor is death. Actually, it's not even a floor, it's just death water. Really slowly moving. Wait. There's about here, and then I have no idea what happens after this. I remember that I really disliked Test Chamber 15. But, uh, I think that's gonna do it for the little first episode of this playthrough of Portal. Uh, if you've enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button. If you like this game as much as I do, slap the like button instead of just hitting it. And yeah, I guess... Okay, well, that was GLaDOS's goodbye to you for this episode. We'll do this test next episode, and well, peace out.